David Evans here, Fit TV Network. You know, um, being a leader to this next generation that's before you, a lot of people are looking up to you. What are, what are the biggest characteristics or, or the character that you want to portray to the next generation? Never allow someone on the outside of the vision to distract you from it. There are going to be people that are in your life that try to deter you from your dreams. And it may not even necessarily be because they don't want you to achieve well, but it's because they're living in fear, right? And they allow fear to stop them from chasing it. So in order to essentially save you from the hurt of chasing that, they'll try to deter you from it, right? So if you have a dream, if you have something that you believe in, if you have something in your soul, every day you wake up and that's all you think about, go be it. And, and what do you tell, again, for your craft? A lot of people say um, faith without works is dead, which is true. But what about putting the work in? Have you just uh, learned that secret? You just can't have the faith, but you got to have the works, too, putting the work in so you can get the results out of what you do. Um, it's just like working out. Wow. You know, in order to get stronger, you have to work every day. You know, you may have a couple rest days. But if you want to get stronger, you have to lift heavier weights, right? It's the exact same thing in every other space of your life. If you don't work towards the things that you say that you actually want, um, do you actually want them? You know? If you allow the no's to stop you, do you actually want them? You know? So every single day that I wake up, I do something to progress me towards what it says that I want to do, which is to be one of the greatest r and artists to ever live. So it's, I wake up every day with the energy. Thank you, sir. Beautiful. Awesome. Any other questions? Inspires you, sir. What inspires you? Well, I can tell you who was the first individual to inspire me was Jamie Foxx. Okay. I literally used to sit when I still had dial of internet. I ain't gonna tell you how many times my mama cussed me out. You hear me? Um, she literally used to get on my top because I would be on YouTube for hours on end, watching all of his specials, watching him sing, just his entire or his genius. It's something about just that old down south country like soul. You know what I mean? You can tell that he was raised in the church and emphasized. So uh, yeah, that was, that was my inspiration. That's what started me there. Then uh, I went to an advanced um, school in elementary. My I used to actually used to play violin. I played violin for like seven years. Wow. So my instructor in first grade, his name is Joe Cripps, he's passed on now. Mm. One of the hardest individuals I think I've ever met in my life, right? But he taught me that music had to be a part of your being if you want to do it. So I've been following him ever since. Hi, you're in the Rogers with the Rogers with you. How you doing, sir? Talk about your thoughts of performing tonight and what it feels like to be here at this year's Oscars. I'm a little, uh, I was a little black boy in Wrightsville, Arkansas. I used to watch BT, and I always told my mom, one day I'm mm. going to be on the stage on BT, and tonight that happened. So to say that, it, that I'm honored would be a disrespectful uh, understatement. I've been chasing, or not necessarily chasing, I have been actively moving towards the same goal my entire life, right? Ever since two, three years old, like I've literally been in love with music. And so to share the stage tonight with, you know, a plethora of amazing artists, it was, I, I can't even literally find the words, man. Like it, it was really amazing. Um, I, I thank God, I, I thank all of my support system, you know, uh, my amazing team. I got Rhonda Aaron, aka Boss Lady, here with me. Uh, an amazing black woman. Uh, my father used to always tell me that if you want to win in life, you got to get a bunch of black women around you and care about you, right? And that's one of those women. So uh, she she makes makes this uh, really easy for me. Absolutely. Thank you for watching this PIC TV Network special presentation. We hope that the insightful content provided valuable information and entertainment to our esteemed viewers. Your support and viewership are essential to the success of our network. To make a donation, go to watchpictv.com or scan the PIC TV QR code. 
Help us build the PIC TV Studio World Training Center.